April 25th is World Malaria Day, and the United Nations has a bold agenda to fight the mosquito-borne disease. The World Health Organization reports 214 million new cases of malaria worldwide in 2015. It says malaria caused 438,000 deaths last year. But on the positive side, 57 countries reduced the number of new malaria cases by at least 75 percent from 2000 to 2015. In Uganda, fighting malaria accounts for the largest share of the country's health budget. A Chinese factory in Kampala has started producing mosquito nets to help cut the cost of imports. CCTV's Michael Belke reports. Final touches at this Chinese factory in Uganda's capital. All these nets are insecticide treated to fight mosquitoes. And as they roll off the production line, households wait for them throughout the country. Nets are one of the avenues of reducing malaria because they are a method of vector control. As people sleep, they are protected from malaria. There is capacity here to produce about 3 million nets a year. The Chinese also plan for expansion to produce up to 10 million mosquito nets for export to countries neighboring Uganda, such as South Sudan. Uganda is a very big market, and as we move to protect the people against malaria, we also want to improve their lives by providing them with employment. Uganda spends 100 million U.S. dollars every three years on importing mosquito nets. Local production means the country will save on the cost of the malaria burden. Government has recently distributed free imported mosquito nets across the country. But the fight against malaria remains a tough one. Malaria is the biggest killer of all diseases in Uganda. Michael Balekesi, CTV, Kampala.